killed Josh on accident. We killed Josh on accident. I like this chick right here. That could be a lot of things. None of them nice. Quit it. <laughs> Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Damn I've it, just man. been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. So have fun. He tricked me that leather shit, man. Oh my god! Oh my god! Shit! There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? Just holla? <laughs> Alright, Christy. I'm, I'm trying not to get any help unless I, like, I just ask for it randomly, but I'm trying to do everything on my own for the most part. That's not good. Unless it's not time yeah, shit. Not I want to see opinions, but there goes that wolf. The clue. <laughs> Guidance. For his squirting, because he was about to bang what's her name, Jessica. <sighs> Is there any totem poles anywhere that I need to know about? I guess not. Oh, you've done all of it, really? You've done all deaths, playthroughs, survivals, and almost all the trophies, and so not enjoying. Oh, wow. So, have you have you saved everybody then? Like, at least one time? You've saved everyone? Alright, here we go. Fuck, something good, please. Something good. White. It's Matt. That was Matt. Good fortune. <clears throat> Some time after, the prospectors came to mine this mountain. And driven mad. Murderers. I grasp beyond my reach. I, a year ago, I was finally able to get him in my sights. <clears throat> Alright. Yeah, my first playthrough got all the way to the end, then made one error and screwed it all up. He had such rage. I bet. I would you only imagine. <laughs> All right, so we we got the dog. That sucks. All the way to the end to mess up. I wish, see, I wish I would have done the same thing, made it all the way to the end without killing anybody. But it's kind of hard. That was my first first actual death in the whole group. 
Josh. Well, unless they killed Jessica, but I don't think Jess died because we're still looking for her. All she did was just fall down in that elevator. But. Yeah, Josh is the first death so far. Explore a little bit. There goes that little door right here. I'm being mind fucked. <laughs> I'm so scared though, like I, I get scared easily. I think I made a bad, nah, I probably didn't make a good decision. out now right I need to be more honest brave romantic <clears throat> keeping some helpful uh, I want to watch this unfold before his eyes nice no total I'm guessing it's white yellow that's good Lost? I thought yellow was good. I thought... Oh, that was brown? Oh, I thought that was yellow. Who was that? Is that... It looks like Matt. I can tell by his little stupid-ass turtleneck and varsity leatherman, leatherman jacket, whatever. Is that Matt? I think that is Matt. Blue and white stripe. I don't think Chris was wearing that. What was Chris wearing? Yeah, I think that's Matt, to be honest. So, a potential loss of a friend is what we got. Brown. Oh, man. I think that's Matt. Some time after, the prospectors came. Mine this mountain and driven mad murderers eating my grasp beyond my reach. I, a year ago, I was finally able to get him in my sight. I was betting, um, Hannah. Alright, one second. I'm gonna be a quick drink real quick, which is like right here. So it's gonna take like six seconds. Got me, uh, two cup, two glasses of water, or bottles of water. Why do I have like white? I don't get it. I need two bottles of water and like a little s snack cake. <clears throat> These are freaking good. Red velvet cake. All right.
coffee shop. I was doing this. <clears throat> Search for a route out of the basement. Going to chap. <clears throat> oh shit, this can't be good. Totem of the Wolf? Yes, I have. This one right here, right? Oh wait, who's this? Chris was offended by Sam's discretion. Chris, Chris is a Sam from Not For Me Nosy. I haven't seen this one yet. Rats with bushy tails. Chris chose not to shoot squirrel. Nature remained in balance. <clears throat> I'm so glad to shoot that squirrel. Ashley encouraged Matt to use the telescope. Matt saw Mike and Emily flirting. All right, Matt confronted Emily. Or Matt confronted Mike. Matt sided with Emily. Or Matt sided with Jessica during the fight with Emily. Oh, I did it. Mike came to Jessica's aid reluctantly. Jessica didn't appreciate Mike's reluctance to help. Reluctance to help. And Mike failed to impress under pressure. Jessica res resisted Mike's advances. Sam found a baseball bat and left it in the cellar. I didn't want to leave it in the cellar though. It didn't give me an option to take it. Mike successfully chased after Jessica. All right. Carissa said that he would save Ashley. I wanted to save Josh. But yeah, this is the one I, um... Later, Callie. Um, I'll show you here in a second. Where's the totem pose at? Here we are. The one with the wolf, right? The guidance. Tell me what that one, Christy. Let me disable this command real quick.
Yeah, I, I'm glad you got it. Okay. I just don't know what it means. Do I, like, follow the wolves or what? Or feed them or some shit? I know it's a thing of guidance, but... <clears throat> Could have sworn I saw, like, a flashing thing back here somewhere. Last of the outside. Save the wolf. I'm doing good so far. That's weird. They just forced them all out. Rescue of miners. Be advised that the miner rescue is due to be completed tomorrow, January 5th, as the number of surviving miners is unknown. Prepare all beds in a ward. In ward A. The press will be in attendance tomorrow and must be seen to be given the miners the best possible care. Note that press visitors, visitors are not allowed to enter the... Failure in regard will reflect badly upon Mr. Bragg and the sanatorium as a whole and shall result in on-the-spot dismissal. You'll need a nose... nose peg? You'll need a nose peg. Those guys smell awful. Oh, I'm gonna just open that door. I'm gonna try to. Oh, uh, yeah. I was gonna save the wolf regardless. I, it, Cause that thing is the yellow of guidance, so I wasn't gonna hit it or anything. Or kill it. Okay, yeah. So I have to go around. Clocking in name cards. That's it. Okay. A bunch of thirty clocking in name cards from the mine locked away in the safe. This means that there were thirty miners trapped in the mine. Wow. camera must have been used for filming the lens of this camera is smashed looks like someone did this on purpose
This must be the camera mentioned in newspaper articles. Someone really didn't want these pictures getting out. A newspaper dated 1952 with a story about a reporter being, being banned from visiting a group of rescued miners. The reporter had his camera confiscated. A reporter from the Alberta Bogle was assaulted and hospitalized yesterday by security personnel at the Blackwood Sanatorium. Chuck Bernstein, a senior news reporter, was seeking an interview with the miners dramatically rescued on Tuesday. The man had been trapped underground for over three weeks after a structural collapse at the Northwest Mine in December and now are being treated at Blackwood Sanatorium for malnutrition and trauma. Jefferson Bragg, sole proprietor of, the, of both Northwest Mining Company and the Blackwood Sanatorium, told the Bugle yesterday that the incident was unfortunate and that a full internal inquiry inquiry had been launched. He also claimed that Bernstein had been trespassing on sanatorium grounds without permission. It was believed that the assault arose from an argument about Mercer's camera, which was confiscated immediately at prior to the attack. Okay. Three weeks. Trapped. Report follows are the initial state of the 12 miners after the collapse of the mine and subsequent rescue of Blackwood. On receipt of the 12 patients at the San Antonio's medical facility, we had fully expected to find emaci emaciated shells of men starved and confused. Thankfully, the miners appear cogent and relatively healthy, attributed to their apparent discovery of the emergency food supplies in the mine. Was detected in a few of the older men, as predicted, as well as symptoms of pneumonia. Psychologically, after being trapped for 23 days, the shock of reintegration has been difficult for some of the group. Though their outward health is better than expected, they do seem affected by their time in the mine. Treatment: Due to the delicate nature of some of the patients, we have closed off the A wing of the sanatorium. Psychological evaluations will take place as soon as possible. The men with respiratory problems have undergone a bronchos. And I prescribed a course of streptomycin. Streptomycin. Damaged or simply kept under strict wing for observance. One of these guys actually tried to bite me. I'm going to report it to Dr. Bowen. Ah, oh, shit. Report mentions 12 miners, but there were 30 clocking in cards re retrieved from the mine. There's no indication of what happened to the other 18. They probably turned to those weird ass creatures. second. I work Saturday night, man. Saturday night. And Sunday.
A chair with leather straps to return a patient. There's blood on it. it. Looks like it was used as part of a weird experiment. Hope survivors received that sanatorium showing signs of mental trauma and demanding to contain. Local press now have a scent of blood becoming a problem. Please advise further. The mine owners were trying to cover up something. According to Telegram, the, the owners were trying to cover this up. Swig. I'm scared. Wouldn't you be T ribs? The shorter it is, more leverage for that particular item right there. Chop it off, you're gonna die. 
Yeah, right. I survived that shit. I was so close, man. I was so close to chopping my fingers off. This place just gets better and better. <laughs> Shut up, Swag. I always keep the machete. Oh man. Mike freedom some of the bear trap. He no longer has a usable machete. Great. Are you serious? Not gonna find a fucking key card? Another tag. <clears throat> Mortuary tag. Name on it reads Nicholas Bowen. February 24th, 1952. He attacked by inmate. Fatal lacerations to throat. I have a feeling if I open one of these up, like, these shits are gonna, like, come out and kill my ass. Ben. <laughs> you love this? Might be a bad idea, but Another one. Another one. Yo, lunch. Appreciate the follow, man. <sighs> Much appreciated, buddy. Isn't this a quaint little psycho crib? <clears throat> Probably should open up the other gate. That's what I thought. I thought the wolf was supposed to guide me. But there's two of them. 
There's two wolves. Right. Back in here. What up, Pri? Easy, boy. Easy. That's a good boy. That's right. What's up, Pri? Piece of me hanging over there. I was gonna get it first and then give it to him. No, I'm gonna pet the wolf. That was a totem. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, Chrissy. I was gonna pet it regardless. I just wanted, I didn't know if I had to go find like a piece of meat or some shit to make it like me. Mike didn't kick the wolf. Mike made a friend. Nice. Chillin' man, you got work today, man? Run or hide on the same page. Self-defense, who gets the gun? Save yourself. Four warnings, four arms. Stick together, point blank, one spin, left behind, important discovery, there's a little chaos. Hold on. on. Alright. So, what have we here? Nice, I made jacket keep warm. <coughs> and a gun? gate and follow the mysterious man. let us out early that's good dude that's always good but what is today today's thursday right today's, today's friday right shit that's right it's friday a map of the mountain sightings and recent disappearance marked with dates look at the work of uh, steps in mind it's definitely that fucking janitor guy shit dude that's good though man you got anything planned for the weekend
See if there's any more clues around here. Before I actually open that shit. There's nothing over here. I don't know if I give that bone to that wolf or not. So I guess if, if this gate doesn't open, we'll go out the one out, out the one where the um, the wolf is at. No, oh. <clears throat> I can't back out now. Damn it, I came back out right. <laughs> Didn't even check how much ammo he had. Photograph only showed 12 survivors. 30 clocking in mines. Rescued after the cave in. 52 the places that all 12 men survived. There were 30 clocking in cards. So there's 18 that were kept away from everybody else. Oh, I told him. That's not good. Sometime after, the prospectors came to mine this mountain. And driven mad murderers. Eating. My grasp beyond my reach. A year ago, I was finally able to get him in my sights. So it looks like Mike's gonna be dying, possibly. Which is this guy right here. You know, let me go get give that dog the bone. I didn't pick up the bone for no reason. Yeah, 
Yeah. <laughs> Easy, boy. Easy. Good guy. You like that? Yeah. You know, everyone likes a little loving, right? So I guess. Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought I can go through that gate behind him. Guess not. Maybe I came back and I see uh, this. The Stogie stash exposed. <clears throat> Must be someone in the mountain. The label isn't the same as the cigar box found right there. All right. So the, the last cigar that we found earlier is the same one as that. All right, now let's go. <clears throat> Shut up, Jay. This chat dies at the most random times. <laughs> So me going to all these dark places. My oh, fuck you, bitch pussy. <laughs> Picking up more clues than some do the whole game. Fair play. I like to do that though. I like to explore. I don't like to leave anything that unexplored. Even though this game is more about the the things you do in this game, predict the the future. You know the outcome of it. So like opening up a door could lead to like the wrong you know, outcome. Which sometimes, sometimes I don't want to open doors and drawers. Like I missed a drawer upstairs and when I found that key, I didn't open up the other one because I found what I wanted. I didn't want one of those fucking creatures to come kill me. Of course, locked. Don't tell me I have to shoot it again. You're wasting your ammo. Oh shit. Run, dick. 